the ways of the nation be like them and belong to them, other tribe and people. Worldly, but the customs of the people are worthless dies forever. They cut trees out of the forest, the classmen first shapes it into money buildings, etc. idols. And those, and those who, to speak up for them are like them and belong to them. I summon you my name, bestow you God of honor, I am the Lord, and there is no other apart from me, there is no God, no God. I will strengthen you, God's righteous people and tribe, like him, spiritual, those that belong to God himself, and will live forever in his kingdom. Amen, amen. without you. Um, hope I remembered. Um, I haven't sung it for a really, really long time, so excuse me. Um, so I'm going to try to play it by ear. I didn't have time for a new one this week. This week went by like that. Um, I got really busy, so um, anyway, it's called Without You, Lord, Who Am I?
Okay, excuse me, pardon me. All right, everybody. Like I said, this week went by so fast. Chimney crickets, I kept myself busy. I decided to paint my bathroom. I had flat white paint in on there anyway, and I always had to paint about every six, three to six months anyway. It's bathroom, kitchen paint. Anyway, I got into interior, exterior paint. It's indoor and outdoor paint. So I know it'll last longer. Amen there. His name will last forever. I don't live in legacy. I don't even care if you think the people you remember me. No, I don't. Be long to 
their weaknesses, sicknesses. But not really uncircumcised. Do not love God through the Spirit. Dies forever, abide for them. Jeremiah 10, 10. But the Lord is a true God. He is a living God, the eternal King with Ham. And his kingdom to those that are his righteous faithful are like God himself, spiritual. His true words to say and do, ways and well, and belong to God himself, his righteous tribe of people. Isaiah 45, 4. Excuse me. I, I summon you by name, bestow on you a title of honor. I am the Lord. There is no other apart from me. There is no God. No, there is not. I will strengthen you. God's righteous people and tribe, like him spiritual, those that belong to God himself. I want to live forever in his kingdom. Amen there. Oh, please excuse me here. I'm thirsty. Okay, now remember I've taught you this. A house is a building where we live. When it becomes the home where your heart loves and minds thank to say and do to serve and worship and live live are the things and people worldly like them then it becomes your home in the world starts set forever but when your house 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 is only a building but our home is in God himself to let us serve worship live in our minds to thank God for unto him to say and do his true words we have God's and live and lives in us excuse me like God himself we have Love, life, life, home. Two words, treasures, and promise now that I turn in our Lord turn home with God's, in God's kingdom. Amen. So remember, remember, this lifetime is not about you or the things of people here. It's all about God himself or through him. First and above them, always remember, always remember, love and life are God himself to love first. Remember, you must love him first and become our master. He's our master to worship and best friend. He's also our best friend. Yes, sir. Yes, he is. Amen. Excuse me. Yes, he is. Excuse me. To trust and lean in on to live for and through righteously, truthfully, and God's two words and language to say and do spiritually. He's spiritual. And think about and love first. Flesh 5, 20, 26, for the spirit is in us. God's love, peace, joy, etc. It fills us completely. Yes, it does. And need him all the time, yes we do. Especially right now, amen. And have God's love, life, light, temple, home, treasures, promises forever in our eternal home kingdom. With God himself, amen. Okay, now we are running the race. We're running the race. Will you win the prize or lose? If you choose the things of people here that cuts in on you, cuts in on you, confuse you buying from them. To choose them and their words of lies, ways and will to say and do and be like them. Then you belong to them, choose them, then you lose, 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 and in your life dies forever. But if you choose God Himself and His true words, ways and will to say and do, are like Ham and belong to Ham. Amen. Spiritual and righteous to love and serve. You win the prize of eternal life with God Himself and His kingdom. Amen. There, so remember, okay, okay, now. Let's pray in this time of needing God Himself. Bow your heads, close your eyes. Lord God, you are a real true God, Creator, Savior, Father in heaven. We love you first, and you first love and love us so much. You've given your Son Jesus Christ to die for us in our sins and rose on Easter, conquered death. So we've conquered death with Jesus Christ. We prayed and given Him our sins and let them die completely on His cross. We've been born new in him now we love love, love. serve and follow and live our lives born through him as a disciple in his true words and language righteously to saying these spiritually like English 5 2 26 through the spirit lives in us which is God's love peace joy and we put on the form of God Ephesians 6 10 through 18 and through you O Lord God for you are our shield and our protector and healer at this time of need in you O Lord, Lord God and we obey and obey your Ten Commandments in Exodus 20. Our strong faith is in you. For we are spiritual like you and totally belong to you. Yes, we do. As your righteous people and tribe and children. For we are only strangers here passing through. Yes, we are. 
our real eternal home is within in you. So we'll make it, make it to our eternal home and kingdom and live forever with you, O Lord God Almighty. Amen, amen. Excuse me, pardon me, I'm thirsty. Okay, now remember 1 John 4, 3 to 6, you dear children are God, are from God, God, God. And overcome them, your idle sins and lies, because the one who, God himself, God himself was in you is greater than the one who was in the world, that's right. They are from the world and speak words of lies, sins and idols of the world, and the world listens to them. We are from God, 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 and whoever knows God of truth listens to us. But whoever is not from God does not listen to us, that's right. And God's words are true. This is how we recognize the spirit of truth of God and the spirit of falsehood, uh, lies, and sins, idols of the devil. Amen, amen. Okay, now, I told you last week this is just our test, test, test. That who or what we lean on and put our trust in on to let us worship. And then our eyes going through to God's righteous and faithful. Have God's love, life, light, and home, and promise us eternally in His kingdom. Or to the altar sinners and liars, fails the test, fails, fails, fails the test, death and darkness forever. Amen, amen. Okay, now, this week's Bible verse is Psalm um, 73 1. Surely God, God is good to Israel, God's righteous people and tribe, to those who are pure and hard, God's love. Amen. Okay, now. The God idol that you use here to let us worship, to say and do lies, didn't create the heavens, earth, and us, or give you eternal love, life, home, treasures, and promise. No, they don't. They cause, 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 and gives you eternal death and darkness forever. But from them, only God Himself created the heavens, earth, and us. Our real true God to love Him first. You must always love Him first, always as our real true love, because He is serve, worship, and best friend. And it is real true words to say and do, to live for and do righteous, the truth, and spiritual. And you'll have His love, life, home, treasures, like and promise. Now and thought eternity in God's home and kingdom. Amen. So we are to be genuine, true. We are to be genuine, true, and into God Himself, refined by His fire. Prove to be his righteous tribe and people, genuine, genuine, true, true, true. That's eternal with God himself and his kingdom. Amen, amen there. Okay, pardon me. Okay, now you lost flying from the ways and will of this world's own wants and desires. That sign to say and do the wrong ways and choices and words that ends dies forever by and from them. Be found in it through Christ Jesus as this two words ways and will to say and do the right ways and choices and true words. That's forever with Jesus Christ and his kingdom. Amen. Okay, now, this week's children lesson is for everyone. Okay, now let's say, there's a page you're missing from a book you're reading, okay? The book's not complete. No, it's not. Well, that's how we are here without God himself. You want complete. A part of you is missing, so you search for it elsewhere. Yes, you do. You search for it elsewhere. Through other things and people. To feel the missing part of yourself. But you just crave and lust for more. To say and do, you're like them to worship, to love and serve. In other words, you never get enough. No, you don't whatever it is, but you'll never be complete. No, you won't. Have enough, and you ain't die forever. Only God himself makes you complete. Let him fill you completely. The fruit of the Spirit of Galatians 5, 20 26. God's love, peace, joy, etc. lives in you. To worship, love, and serve righteously is two words, and our spiritual like God himself to say and do, and you'll be completely united together with God in his kingdom and live forever. Amen. So right now, let Jesus Christ purify you, make you new and reborn into him. Let your idle sins, lies, die, 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 die. Pray right now. Pray right now and give them to him. And let them die, die completely on his cross. And he will purify you from them and free you and make you new, 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 reborn in him. Now live your lives born to him. To say and do his two words of language, righteously, truthfully, and spiritually. To let serve and be master, be mastered from him and follow him. To be his true disciple and Christian righteous tribe and people towards an everlasting home in his kingdom and live forever with him. Amen. Okay, now let's pray. Bow your heads and close your eyes. 
our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses, we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil, for thine is kingdom, power, and glory for every man. Okay, everybody, get your holy Bibles out. Okay, um, let's give me a lot of Bible verses. Remember in the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth and us, and He even gave us our first breath of life here in Genesis 1 and 2. Amen, amen. Remember that. In Exodus 3, Moses in the burning bush, God Himself spoke through Moses in the burning bush. Amen. Remember that. Amen, amen. John me 31, 6 and 8. Be strong and courageous for unto God himself righteously. Do not be afraid or terrified because of them. For the Lord your God goes with you. He will never leave forsake you. No, he doesn't. The Lord himself goes before you. He will be with you. He will never leave you. Amen. Man, I'm at one five. Psalms almost over, pardon me. Okay, everybody. Nama 1 5. Excuse me, I'm gonna check and be sure this is centerized. Pardon me for a second, okay? I want to double check and be sure this is centerized. Pardon me for a second. Okay, I just want to be sure it's centerized. Pardon me here. Alright, everybody. I don't even know where I left off. <laughs> Pardon me here for a second. I don't even know where I left off. Pardon me. Amen. I trust you in everything. Gotta trust him in everything. Amen. Amen. That's right. I don't know where I left off. Pardon me here. I forgot to bend the page. Isaiah 45, 5. name and bestow you a title of honor through you. Though you do not acknowledge me, me, I am the Lord and there is no other apart from me there is no God. I will strengthen you, though you have not acknowledged me. So that from the rising of the sun to the place where it's setting people may know there is none besides me, me, me. I am the Lord and there is no other. I form the loud dialogue and create darkness. I prosperity and create disaster. I, the Lord, do all these things. You have as above rain down righteousness. Let the clouds shower it down. Let the earth open wide. Let salvation spring up. Let righteousness grow with it. I, the Lord, have created it. Woe to the person who quarrels with the person's maker. The person, to the person who is but a Potsherd, whatever that means. Among the potsherds on the ground, the ground will die forever. Does the clay say to the potter, What are you making? Does your work say, He is no, he has no hands. Woe to the person who says to the person's father, What have you begotten? Or to the person's mother, What have you, you brought to birth? Lord says, the Holy One of Israel and His Maker, concerning things to come, do you question me about my children or give me orders about the work of my hands? It is I who made the earth and created mankind upon it. My own hand stretched out the heavens. I, I, hush their sorry hosts. I will raise up God's righteous people serves in my righteousness. I will make all the person's ways straight. The, the righteous person will rebuild my city and set my exiles free, but not a price or reward, says the Lord Almighty. This is what the Lord says. 
And those someone they will come over to you, they will come over to you and and will be yours. They were tooting behind you, to behind you, coming over to you in chains. They will bow down before you and plead with you, saying, Surely God, God is with you. And there is no other, there is no other God else in life. Truly you are a God, God, God who hides himself. O oh God and Savior of Israel, all the maker of idols will be put to shame and disgrace dies forever. They will go off into disgrace together, die throughout eternity. But Israel will be saved by the little Lord, God's righteous people with an everlasting salvation. You will never be put to shame, disgrace. Two ages everlasting for this is what the Lord says. He who created the heavens, he is God. He who fashions and makes the earth, he founded it. He did not create it to be empty, but formed it to be inhabited. He says, I am the Lord. There is no other. I have not spoken in secret from this. Somewhere in the land of darkness, I will. I have not said to Jacob's descendants, God's righteous people, see me in vain, seek me in vain. I, the Lord, speak the truth, the truth, the truth. Amen. His words are true. I declare what is right born to him. Gather together, come, assemble you fruitiles from the nations everywhere. Ignorant are those who carry about idols, idol sins, and lies. Of wood, money, buildings, etc., who pray to God, God, gods that cannot save, 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 though they and die forever. Declare what is to be presented. Let them take the counsel together. Who foretold this long ago? Who, de who declared it from the distant past? Was it not I, the Lord? And there is no God apart from me, a righteous God and a Savior. There is none but me. Turn to me and be saved, for unto God Himself. Be saved, for God, for unto God Himself. All you ends of the earth, everyone, for I am God. There is no other. By myself I have sworn my mouth utters in our integrity. O oh, word that will not be revoked before me, me every knee will bow. By me every tongue will swear. They have said to me in the Lord alone our righteousness and strength. They will say of me, me, me in the Lord alone our righteousness and strength, strength, strength born to him. All who have raged against him, all who come to himself, the person self will be put to shame, dies forever. But the Lord God, all the sins of Israel, God's righteous people, will be found righteous and will exalt, rise, and live forever with God Himself. Amen, amen. In His kingdom. Remember that. Okay, pardon me. Like I said, I had a long week. Pardon me. Okay, you brought me to. Pardon me, he's giving me a lot of Bible verses. Excuse me. Based on this week's, and was part of last week's as well. Jeremiah 10. The Lord God says, Do not learn the ways, la la lies, of the nation, worm be worldly like them, their idle sins and lies. For their customs are worthless, will die forever by and from them. Amen. Remember that. You will die forever by and from them. Amen, amen. Jeremiah 31, which are other tribes and people. Okay, Jeremiah 31. At this time, declares the Lord, I will be the God God of all clans of Israel, and they will be my righteous people. This is what the Lord says. People will survive the sword, so sword, and will find favor in the desert. I will come and give rest to Israel, God's righteous people. The Lord appeared to us in the past, saying, I have loved, loved you. He loves us with an everlasting love. Remember, it's everlasting. I have drawn you with a loving kindness. I will Build you up again, and you will be rebuilt. Rebuild, O Virgin Israel, God's righteous people. Again, you will take up your tamblings and go to dance with joy. God is five twenty twenty six. God's love, peace, joy. Again, you will plant vineyards and Miss Mary plant them. Enjoy their fruit. There will be a day when watch will cry out on the hills of from where you live. Come, come, let's go up to the Zion. Zion, Mount Zion, to the Lord our God. This is what the Lord says. Sing for joy. 
sing with Joy Glace 2026. God's love peace, Joy. For Jacob shall from and foremost of the nations make your praise by God's love heard and say, O Lord, O Lord, save your righteous people, the remnant of Israel, his new holy city. See, I will bring them from the land of the north and gather them to the ends of the earth. Among them will be the blind and the lame. Except their mothers and women and lay my great throne and return. They will come with weeping, they will pray, and I will bring them back, I will bring them back. I will lay them beside streams of water on level paths where they will not stumble, because I am Israel's father. God. Hear the word of the Lord of the nations, everyone proclaim in the distance, coastlands everywhere. He who scattered Israel, God's people, will gather them. He will gather them and will watch over his flock, his righteous people, like a shepherd, ruler. Maybe he's a ruler, he's a king. The Lord will ransom Jacob and redeem, save them from the hands of those who are stronger than they. You will come and shout for joy, joy, Galatians 5, 20 years, God's love, peace, joy in the heights of Mount Zion, Mount Zion is new city where us righteous will live. You will rejoice in the bounty of the Lord, the grain, wine, oil, grain, wine, the maiden stands with glad, your young men will live. I will turn their mourning to gladness, I will give them comfort and joy, Galatians 5, 20 years, God's love, peace, joy instead of sorrow. I will satisfy the peace of abundance of my people, righteous people, be filled with my bounty, the curse of the Lord, this is what the Lord says, the voice is heard, mounting a great weeping, weeping, and refusing to be comforted because the children are no more, this is what the Lord says, restrain your voice from weeping and your eyes from tears. For your work will be rewarded for unto God himself, declares the Lord. They will return from the land of the enemies, say fathers and liars. So there is hope, 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 hope in your future. God's righteous people, declares the Lord, your children, God's righteous people, return to their land. I will surely prepare them, you discipling us like an unruly calf. And I have been discipling by and from God. Restore me and I will return. Because you are the Lord my God, after I have strayed, I have repented, prayed, and given him my idle sins and lies, and let them die completely. After I came to understand, I'd be a best, I would humble, it was disgraceful for my youth. Though I spoke against him, I still remember him, therefore my heart yearns for him. I have great passion. Because the Lord set up road signs for him through God, put up guideposts. Take note of the highway, take the road. You take return, O virgin Israel, God's righteous people. Return to your town, town, towns. How long will you wander? Oh, unfaithful daughter people, the Lord will create a new thing on earth. Yes, he will. A woman surround man. This is what the Lord Almighty says, the God of Israel says, when I will bring them back, back from the cavity of the people in the land. And the towns will once again Use these words, the Lord, 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 bless you, O righteous people, descend the mountain, Jake. God's people will live together, will live together, farmers and everyone and their flocks. I will refresh and worry, satisfy the fame. At this time I woke and looked around, my sleeping in was pleasant to me. The days are coming, declares the Lord, when I will plant the house. And, and the offsprings of people and the animals, just as I watched over you, to a bread to uproot and tear down, to overthrow, destroy, and bring disaster, disaster. So I will watch over you to rebuild and plant, to rebuild and plant, declares the Lord. In those these days, people will no longer say, if all the parents have eaten grapes on the edge and said, everyone will die of his own sin, sin, sin. Whoever eats sour grapes, the, the person's own teeth will be set on edge. The time is coming, declares the Lord, when I will make a new covenant and promise to the house of Israel, God's righteous people, and I will be like the covenant promise I made with your forefathers when I took them out of the hand to lead them out of Egypt when they were enslaved and mastered, buying from altar sinners and liars. Because they broke my covenant, though I was, I am a husband to you, declares the Lord. He's members our spouse. This covenant I will make with 
the house of Israel, God's righteous people, after that time declares the Lord, I will put my law under my, my mind and write them on hard by God's love. I will be the God and they will be my righteous people. No longer will a person teach the person's neighbor or a person, the person's brother, saying, Know the Lord, because they will know me, me, me. From least of them to the greatest, declares the Lord, the Lord. Amen. For I forgive their wickedness out of sins and lies, and will remember their sins no more. This is what the Lord says. He who appointed the sun to shine by day, who decrees the man and stars to shine by night, who stirs up the seas, such ways roar the Lord Almighty is his name. Only if these decrees vanish on my side, declares the Lord, all the sins of Israel will cease as a nation. Before me, as the Lord said, the heavens above can be measured, the fountains of the earth below be searched out. Will I re reject all the sins of Israel because you, all of you, have done what you have done, declares the Lord? The days are coming, declares the Lord, when the city will be rebuilt, rebuilt for me. Put the tail hand to the corner gates. The measure will stretch from there straight the hill. Give them to go up the whole valley where the dead, dead bodies are, are the liars, sinners. Idolaters are thrown and all the terrors out of the Kenan Valley in the east, the east as far as the corner of the horse gates. will be holy, holy to the Lord the city. The city will never again be uprooted or demolished. Amen, amen. He brought me that one.
trumpet and then do him, amen, amen. He's always here for us, he never leaves us, forsakes us. Members of love and life are everlasting, amen, amen. All other sins die here. Amen. Luke 6, 27. But I tell you here, may love your enemies by God's love and brother, sister love. Do good for one through God to those who hate you. Bless those who curse you, amen. Pray for those who mistreat you. If someone strikes you on the cheek, well, we don't do that anymore. Give to everyone who asks you. If anyone takes what belongs to you, do not demand it back. Do to others as you would have them do to you. Remember that. If you love those who love you, what what is it to you? Even sinners love those who love them. And if you do good, good to those who are good, born to God, to you, what good is that to you? Even sinners, wait a minute, excuse me. Let me read this again. And if you do good to those who are good to you, what good is that to you? Even sinners, sinners do that. And if you lend to those who you expect repayment, what good is that to you? Even sinners lend to sinners expecting to be repaid in full. But love your enemies by God's love. And brother, sister, love do good and into God to them. And lend to them without expecting to get anything back then your reward will be great. And you will be children of the Most High, God's children, because He is kind to the ungrateful and wicked out your sinners and liars. Be merciful as your Father God in heaven is merciful. Do not judge or you be judged. Do not condemn or you and give. And it will be given to you, excuse me, a good measure, measure down, shakes together, and running or will be poured into the, your laps. For with the measures you use, the measure you use, it will be measured to you. Remember that. He also told them this parable. Can a blind man lead a blind man? Will they not both fall to the pit, death, hell, forever? The student is not above his Jesus Christ teacher, which is Jesus Christ. But everyone who is fully trained, trained will be like his teacher, Jesus Christ. Why do you look at the speck in your brother's eyes and pay no attention to the speck in your own eye? How can you say to your brother, brother, let me take the speck out of your eye when you have one in your own? You hypocrites, first take the plank out of your own eye and then you will see clearly to remove the speck from your brother's eye. No good tree, no good tree. Bears bad fruit, nor does a bad tree bear good fruit. Each tree is recognized by its fruit. People who do not people do not pick figs from thorn bushes or grapes from briars. Excuse me, the good person born through God brings good things. Born through God out of the good stored up in the person's heart by God's love. And the evil out of sinners and liars, the, the person brings evil things out of the evil out of sins and lies stored up in the person's heart, what they love. For out the old flow of the, of the person's heart, what he loves, the person speaks. Why do you call me Lord, Lord, and do not do what I say? I will show you what he is, the person's like who comes to me, me, and hears my two words and puts them into practice. He is like a person who builds a house who dug down deep and laid the foundations on rock. When the flood came, the torrent struck that house but could not shake it because it was well built. But the one who hears my words of truth and does not put them into practice is like a person who builds a house on the ground without a foundation. The moment the torrent struck that house, it collapsed with its destruction, and destruction was complete, dies forever. Amen, amen, remember that. Um, he brought me that when I don't ask questions. Okay, um, Luke 16, 13, 15. No servant can serve two masters, either you will hate the one and love the other, be devoted to the one, despise the other. You cannot serve both God and money or whoever, whatever else you love, serve and worship here and are master by and from. Remember that, and man, you're gonna be mastered by and from one or the other. Amen, amen. You must be mastered by and from God Himself. Amen, amen. He's gotta be our master. To love and serve. 
to live for and do in his words of truth and language. Righteously, truthfully, and be spiritual like him. Amen, amen. That's eternal within him forever. Amen, amen. And he's also our best friend. Amen, amen. Sing praise. The love that comes from God because you love him. Sing joy for the grace of God. 22 and 26. God's love, peace, joy, etc. John 5, 41 to 47. Amen, amen. John 8, 23. You see you. Pardon me here. He really keeps me busy. Hold on here a second. Faith, hope, family. I think I read this. Excuse me. Pardon me for a second. Okay, yeah, he wants me to read this. Pardon me. To the Jews, God's rich people who believed in him, Jesus. If you hold to my teaching words of truth, you are really my disciples of Jesus. Then you will know the truth, and the truth will set you free. They answered him, We are Abraham's descendants, have never been slaves, slaves, slaves. Of anyone, how can you say that we both shall be free? We both should be shall free. Jesus replied, I tell you the truth, everyone who sins, 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 is slave to sin. Now a slave has no permanent place in the family of God, but a child belongs to it forever but a son child excuse me hold on a second but a child belongs to it forever so if Jesus Christ sets you free if you live born through Jesus Christ you will be free indeed by and from them I know you are Abraham's descendant and you are ready to kill me says Jesus because you have no room for my words of truth I am telling what I have seen in my heavenly father's presence and you do what you have heard from your father Abraham our forefather they said if you were Abraham's children said Jesus then you would do the things Abraham did as for you determined to kill me a person who has told you the truth that I have heard from God himself says Jesus Abraham did not do the things you are doing the things your own father does we are not a human children they said the only father we have is God himself Jesus said to them, If God God were your father, you would love me. For I came from God, and now I'm here. I have not come on my own. But he sent me. Why is my language of truth not clear to you? Why is his language of truth not clear to you? Because you aren't able to hear what I say, said Jesus. You belong to your father, the devil, the devil, the devil, which are his idle sins and lies. And you want to carry a your father's desires which are your own wants and desires that sing he was a murderer from the beginning not holding to the truth for there's no truth in him no there's not when he lies he speaks his native language for he is a liar and the father lies yet because i tell the truth of god you do not believe me says jesus can you prove me guilty of saying if i am telling the truth of god why don't you believe me person, the person, the person who belongs to God, God, God. Here's what God says. God's words are true. The reason you do not hear what God says is that you do not belong to God himself. Amen, amen. Remember that as well. Okay, pardon me here. And Romans 9, 1. I speak the truth in Christ Jesus. I am not lying. My conscience confirms in the Holy Spirit of God himself. Amen, amen. Okay, spiritual gifts, 1 Corinthians 12. We all have a spiritual gift as we live through the Spirit. Amen, amen, as we live born through the Spirit of God. Amen, amen. Okay, do not be yoked together with unbelievers, idolaters, sinners, and liars, for we have nothing in common with them as believers and righteous and faithful in God. Amen, amen. We have nothing in common with unbelievers I don't trust sinners and liars remember that amen amen do not be yoked with them don't be friends with them amen okay well he's giving me a lot of bible verses I don't want to run out of minutes in my cam recorder so pardon me here remember this Galatians 5 19 next sinful nature obvious sexual morality sexual morality impurity debauchery allergy witchcraft hatred discord jealousy fits of rage self which are your own wants and desires, assertions, faction, envy, and drunkenness, and lies. I warned you, as I did before, those who live, <coughs> excuse me, live like this when I'm here to turn life with God. But the fruit of the Spirit, which, are, which is God's love, 
joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, self-control. Against such there is no law. Those who belong to Christ Jesus have crucified, given their idle sins and lies to the cross, and let them die completely. The sinful nature with his passions and desires, since we live by the Spirit of God, let us keep in step with the Spirit of God. Let us not become conceited and full of enemy in each other. Amen, amen. Remember that. And put on the form of God, Ephesians 16 through 17. Amen, amen. And remember, remember, Philippians 4, 13, you can do everything through Christ Jesus who gives us strength and into Him. Remember that. Amen, amen. Okay, I don't want to mess up my cam recorder, so pardon me here. I gotta drop this off my sons and me and my younger son's gonna go out to eat. Number one, love God himself first. He always comes first. Remember that as I wrote to love, <clears throat> Revelation 2, 4, and spouse. <clears throat> Excuse me, I got tickled in my throat. Pardon me. I got allergies. Pardon me. <clears throat> you guys don't know me by now. Every spring and fall, I get allergies bad, so pardon me. It's been like that for what? At least four or five years. Amen. Every spring and fall, you guys I don't know by now. I get allergies bad. Jeremiah 3.14, the Lord God says, I am your husband's spouse, spouse to and promise to serve, worship. As our God, the fruit of the Spirit, Galatians 5, 20, 26, God's love, restore, etc., lives in us and fills us completely the void. And words of truth to say and do right to truth in the Spirit, so they and our spirits are like Him and belong to Him completely. You gotta belong to Him completely. And put on former God, Ephesians 16 through 18. And I can do everything through Christ who strengthens me, Philippians 4, 13 through faith. And God Himself and the Bible, God's Ten Commandments, Acts 20, and trust in God, trust also in Mrs. Jesus, John 14, 1. I bear in my body the marks of Jesus, Galatians 6, 7, for unto Him, and always ask for saying and doing. What would you say and do? Say and do the right things and choices for unto Him, and be His righteous people, tribe, so we'll make it to our Lord, turn home in His kingdom, and live forever. Amen. Number two, come to your house, spouse in yourself. Number three, come to work for five hours a week. More than that, then your work hog, he does an aisle. To lesser and worship. Number four comes the two friends. My number one purpose for my organization is to preach the gospel, the real God's truth, and his kingdom of eternal life and save his people. Number two is our people. Number three is how make our community and state a better, safe place to live. I've emailed the governor on Peoria and these for some issues. I'm working on one thing at a time and picking up trash in my neighborhood. So please pick up trash. In your neighborhood, we can walk in our neighborhood, so, right now. <clears throat> to help keep it clean from trash to breathe, thanks God bless you if you do. Okay, now I'm an ordained pastor, so if you need my services, prayers, or have an idea to help make our community <clears throat> a better, safe place to live, you can email me. It's on the site, number 224. Okay, now for children, the zoos have videos to watch for free. Amazon has free children's shows. There are things to do. And read the Bible and children's lesson and pray to God in the morning. And meals in the bedtime every day. That's especially important to keep our strong faith in God himself. Remember, he's our hope, H-O-P-E. Our strength in him, our healer, our protector, our one true God creator, and only he is love, life, light, temple, treasures, home, and truth and promise that's turning with him in his kingdom. So we need him all the time, especially right now. Doing from the trials and tribulations that come at us all the time, all the sins and lies. So we're saying do the right things and choices for through God himself and be righteous like him, belong to him completely. Trust and lean on in him. And he will help us. He is. He's our shield. Put on the former of God, Ephesians 5, 22, 26 is God's through the spirit. Galatians 5, 20, 26 lives in us, God's love, peace, joy, etc. And it's two words in language, so we'll say and do the right things. Righteously born to him, spiritually, he is also our healer, life savior. Remember, we bear in our bodies the marks of Jesus. Galatians 6, 7, for through him, our hurt and pain as we live through. Jesus Christ, remember, he suffered and died for us in our sins and rose on Easter. That's a few weeks away. Conquer them for us as we live our lives for unto him. Even our hurt and pain as we bear our, on our bodies the marks of Jesus for unto him. As we love, serve, follow him, 
and his true words and language to say the righteous truth spiritually and his true disciples, Christian tribe and people to live for and through. So we'll excuse me. We'll make it make it and live forever with Jesus Christ and his kingdom and live forever. Amen. Okay now to help us watching my sermons on the wife, okay, I want to thank business pastors, organizations, police and fire departments nurses, mail carriers, restaurants, deliverers, hospitals, etc. Through this time right now, and the river plaques for my mental, physical, and social health, and my youngest daughter goes with me sometimes, and OS up there, and we'll be open on April the 8th, April the 8th, since there's a shelter in place order until then, so I won't be on Pure's Riverfront until then. It'll be on the site, but I still want to thank Peoria's Parks District, and God bless you for them. Okay, now I want to, I know time is hard, excuse me. I know time is hard right now, but keep your strong faith in God himself. Don't blame him, no, don't blame him. It's just our test, test, test of who or what we lean on and put our trust in on. So pass the test, the test, in God himself, lean on trust in him, and keep your strong faith in him to love first. As our real true love, as he first loved, loves us. And he even gave his one and only son, Jesus Christ, to be born over 2,000 years ago on Christmas. Remember that for us. And over 30 years later, he suffered, died on Good Friday, and rose on Easter for us and our sins. So we are to give, pray. Give him your sins and let them die completely on his cross right now. Let him die and rise and live on through Christ Jesus and be reborn new in him to love, serve, follow in his true words, language, and be his Christian disciple, righteous tribe and people and pass the test, pass the test of eternal life with him is kingdom, amen. Okay, now remember, I should be dead three times. Twice I've had cancer, once I had their death experience, the last time I had cancer, I got down my hands and knees, I did. Pray, cry, fast, and meditate, and scream for days, I did. I've totally submitted myself, gave myself to God, died, died, and been reborn new in Him. And made Him a promise, I tell the real God's truth, I belong to Him now completely, and my tumors disappeared, this is the real God's truth. And when I had a near-death experience, I've seen both Jesus heaven and the, and the devil hell. So they really are both places. So whoever, whatever you love, serve, and worship, and live your lives for and through is truly where you in on Jesus' eternal judgment day to his righteous and faithful, has his love life light home eternally with him. Or to the altar sinners and liars, death and dogs forever. Amen. Okay, now in my multifamily apartment house, I painted my bathroom. Believe me, I needed it. And I'll concentrate on the yard this week with all the rain we've gotten this time to mow, etc. So that'll help keep people busy. Amen. And okay, now on this side, you can't do a little some of my songs. I'm working on them. So I'll have more soon. And I preach and sing every week and try to write a new song. My youngest son helps me. It's a day or two late. And for donations, I've taught you one teas and offerings. We are to give a tenth of our money to God, or you are robbing. God and under his curse, Deuteronomy 14, 22, and 23, and Malachi 3, 8, 9. Thanks, God bless you if you do donate. And Missing Children of Central Illinois, they're also on the site, and I have more soon. My older son hasn't put them on the site yet, and there's a 21-year-old, excuse me, I hope my camera recorder don't go off. If it does, I apologize. I might have to plug it in. Probably about ready to go out. John Perry Hutcherson, who's missing, has been... So it hasn't been seen since November. He's disabled. Black, 5'11", 120 pounds, brown eyes and mustache. His picture's on Channel 25 side. If you have any information on them, call your police departments. I'm working with them. Pray for them and their families. Coronavirus, 14,641 deaths, 335,000 that are sick. For the families and victims, Salt Lake City's earthquake for the victims, Southern Peoria's tornado, power outage, and minor damage uh, from last night for the victims, Australia's fires for the victims, Dan, Pastor Dice, Paul's wife and mother-in-law, Joe, David, and me have health problems. I'll have to find out for sure. I don't think they need help. I don't know. We're not supposed to be in groups of people right now, so I'll pray and meditate on it and see what... It, Anyway, I don't, they said the damage wasn't really bad. I think it just, 
some minor damage. So, anyway, um, Joe, David, and me have health problems. Uh, Robin, Austin, Heather, John, Don, Ron, Donald, and his girlfriend, and 24 and 25 year old daughters, they are going through something personal. Our prison voters of our state cities, voting doctors, nurses, restaurants, mail carriers, truckers. Stores, etc., that are working during the virus. Operation I resolve, pray and give thanks in the morning and meals at night. To God himself from organization song knows I've written him in there. Okay, now I have room on my chemical. I have another song. Okay, now made a love, peace, joy, life, light. Temple home treasure, strength, righteousness, faithfulness, spirit, words of God, teaching, language, article, salvation, praise, glory. Excuse me. Spouse, vows to and promise of God, God himself being with you all. And be ready for Jesus Christ's eternal judgment day, truth and kingdom's snare to his faithful and righteous near his kingdom lives forever, but to the altar sinners and liars, death and darks forever. And the people from the Holy Bible still live in today's world. Amen, amen. And God himself wants love, peace, life, light, even through him, not war, buying from this world, idle sins, lies. Darkness and death, that's the same by and from them. Amen, amen. And us righteous and faithful are truly building God's foundation, united to it together through God Himself, home, temple, kingdom, city for His righteous tribe, people, promise through God, God's treasures of His love, life, excuse me, love, peace, joy, light, temple, life, holiness, righteous faithfulness, spirit, words of truth, teaching, language, articles, traditions, customs, ways, will, glory, praise, salvation, spouse, values, too. Promise will be completely united together with God Himself and His new holy city and live forever with Him. And this will God's truth, amen, amen. And my words of truth of God's are valid, for God is my witness, amen. There. And they will do the true words of God Himself, amen. And God bless America, one nation under God, and God we trust. Amen. Remember, only God, God Himself, our love, life, light temple, home, and treasures and promise that are eternally with him and his kingdom. Amen. Thanks and God bless you. Have a nice and peaceful week in Jesus Christ. And don't be afraid. Don't be discouraged. God's love is forever. The Lord God is with us and in you. He will never leave or forsake you. He is always with and in you. Now without eternity with and in him. In our real eternal home with him and live forever. Amen. Amen. Okay. Well, anyway, uh, I think me and my son's going to go for a walk too in our neighborhood. We can at least do that. I got to pick up trash again anyway. Um, anyway, um, and unfortunately, some changes can be pretty rough. Found my camera core. I have another song. I'm going to make this fast. My camera core is probably about ready to go out. And I might, um, watch my site. I might, since I can't go outside and do things right now, um, since we have to. Stay home, you know, and go to the store and stuff, and as, as we need food and stuff, and, and we can only walk in our neighborhood, etc. Anyway, the bottom line is, um, I might um, sing some songs um, and put it on my site since I can't go on the riverfront right now. Um, anyway, thank you, and God bless you. Have a nice and peaceful week. Thank you. My life belongs to you, Lord God. Um, that's this next song. I gotta make it fast because my camcorder is about ready to go. So you gotta remember that's based on this week's sermon. I should have sung that one earlier. Um, we gotta belong to God Himself. Amen. Amen. Love, serve, follow Him, live our lives for through Him, righteously and truthfully in His words of truth and language. Be spiritual like Him. That's forever within in Him. Amen. Okay, well, anyway, and we wanna be like Him. Okay, well, anyway, I've got to hurry. I don't want to miss my camcorder. My life is yours, Lord God. My life is yours, Lord God. My life is yours, Lord God. I know you're the creator of every one of them, yeah. And I know you. I love life and life and home is everlasting with you. Thank you.
Amen, amen. Okay, well, anyway, I haven't sung that song in a really long time. I wrote that a few months ago. Okay, remember, remember, who do you belong to? You want to belong to God himself. Love, serve, follow him. Live your life for the end, righteously, truthfully. And his words of truth and language.